Our son will be back from United Arab Emirates this month. Yes, I can't wait to see him. He has been abroad for five years. I think he should not come back now. This country is not safe for him. He can stay there and make more money. My husband. I don't like how you sound. You know he misses home. He also need to come look for a wife. There are women there. He can marry and send us the wedding pictures. Anyway he will still come. He can make one month and go back or he can stay. All depends on him. Let's hope he travels safely. Five years is a long time anyways. I am very happy. I will make his favorite food. Charles. You have been running away from me. Today I found you. No. I have not been running away. I am just busy with book work. Nothing much. Where is my 20,000 francs? Which money are you talking about? I lend you 20,000 francs. You promised to pay back after six months. I don't know anything like that. Maybe you are dreaming. Stop playing with me Charles. Please I want my money back. I don't owe you any money. Why are you refusing to pay me? I lend you 20,000 francs at my house. I don't remember anything. Do you have any proof or witness? I don't have any proof. I know you are playing hard. You just go around accusing people of owning you. Just show me any proof that I borrowed money from you. I don't have. You are using your knowledge to take advantage of me, right? I will report you to the police. No problem. If you take me to the police station, I will tell them you are lying. Since you don't have any proof. Dad, I have been here for a month now. Oh yes. I hope you are catching fun with friends. Yes, Dad. I want to tell you something. Go ahead, my son. Come sit down. Dad, I will not go back to UAE. Why? Any problem? There is no problem. You see Dubai is very hard. You work hard without rest. I have been managing for five years now. I understand you. Even though it's hard but it is better than being jobless. Anyway, what do you want to stay in Cameroon and do? I want to start a business. I will rent a store in town. I can buy products from Douala and resell them here. That sounds good. Do you have the capital? I have 5 million. You remember I sent you another 5 million to keep for me. I will need that money to add to this one. Making it 10 million. Good plan. But I thought you have all the 10 million at hand. No dad. I have only 5 million now. When can I get the other 5 million? Give me some time. I will go to the bank and withdraw the money. Thank you dad. Mr. Charles. Did you borrow any money from your friend? Ebenezer. No sir. I did not borrow his money. Tell me the truth. Did you take his money? I'm not lying. I did not take his money. But your friend said you came to his house. You beg him to lend you twenty thousands. Is this true? I think he is lying against me. Officer. All right. Go home. I will call you if you are needed here again. Thank you, officer. I interview your friend Charles. He refused that he did not take your money. Officer. That man is lying. I gave him my money. I gave him a cash sum of 20,000. Mr. Ebenezer. I believe you. But now do you have any written agreement with him? The day he came to borrow money? No. Officer. I did not write any agreement. I lend him the money based on friendship and trust. I understand you very well. Do you have any proof or any witness who saw you lending him the money? No officer. I do not have any witness. I am so sorry for this. I will have to dismiss this case. The reason is because you do not have proof or witness to confirm your claim. I have lost my money. I wish I did not lend him the money. My 20,000 is gone. Next time you will not make same mistake. Go home. Dad. Where is my money? My son calm down. I am not calming down. You lie to me. You will withdraw it from the bank. Why are you doing this? Give me more time. I will give your five million. Dad, tell me the truth. Where is my money? Be patient. Remember I'm your father. Do not raise your voice. I am losing my mind. If I don't get the money, I will take you to the police station. I don't care anymore. My son, do not take me to the station. I will pay you back. I am tired of your lies. You will explain well at the station. You are under arrest. You have the right to remain silent. 
Anything you say will be used against you in the court of law. Officer. What did I do wrong? Your son came to the station this morning. He said you owe him five million. Let's go to the station. Officer don't arrest me. We can settle this at home. Stop pretending. Crying will not help you. Only the truth when we get to the station. Now move it. Move. 